We got a question from Jason Thomas. Jason, you're going to be on the show in a couple of weeks also. Can you help us understand the STR regs in El Dorado, Nevada, and Placer counties? <laughs> We talk about this all the time, and I laugh because it's it's something that everybody wants to know. Um, so those different counties all have different rules. And then also within El Dorado County, you're not just dealing with their regulations, but if you're in South Lake Tahoe, you're dealing with the city of South Lake Tahoe. So we are constantly pointing potential buyers to the right resources to look at which area the house falls within. Because for instance, we've got a client, they own up in West Shore, and uh, they're looking to sell. And so by doing that, they're on the border of El Dorado County versus Placer County. And Placer County is definitely more lenient with their short-term rentals than El Dorado County. Um, they don't have the buffer like we do. And then uh, the city of South Lake Tahoe, we have something called a tourist core. So there's so many different variables, <laughs> but we help point you in the right direction for all of them. Yeah, a lot of, it's actually our question of the week. That's, we just wait, who, who's gonna answer the call to the buyer who has the question about the short-term vacation rentals? And something I try to clarify, which is very hard without sitting down and looking at a map, City of South Lake Tahoe does not allow short-term vacation rentals unless they're within the tourist core area, which there are several places in that tourist core area, mainly on Highway 50. Now, the city of South Lake Tahoe is an incorporated area of El Dorado County, also addressed as South Lake Tahoe. <laughs> so it's only the incorporated city of South Lake Tahoe that does not allow short-term vacation home rentals unless you're in the tourist court.